Interesting. And to start off with these camera shots, like in the trailer. Start off with this. I like that. Eye color. What the heck is this? Is that technically like very similar to like uh, Harmony's high color? Your buddy is bored. Like, just pick already. <laughs> Here, it's me. Eyebrows. I forgot the skill for regular. Can't even see my eyebrows. You now we'll go classic shorts. I can always change it. Why does this have free things on it though? God, never mind. I'll go for the pants. Oh, that's why it has three different things on it. You can go rip, pattern, or reverse colors. I like those colors, though. If we're ready to go. Oh, yeah, you're a buddy. Okay, that just looks funny. We'll go with that one. Yep, this is us. What's going on with him now? Oh, he's like, hey, there's a weapon in here. Alright, well, let's just get this done with, and then we'll be at the plaza in no time. Ah, here comes the train! Let's get teleported to it. Some funny looking tumbleweeds in the back. Oh wow, we actually hear the Splatfest music now. That's some good foreshadowing. Oh dang! That's some lighting. I was gonna say, is this just autoplay now? Ah, we got some surprise faces on them. <laughs> Oof. I guess you, I guess you don't need to make Shiver's eyes smaller to make her look surprised, considering that her eyes are already, her pupils are already. <laughs> oh shoot! I pressed A, but. Frey has an anger emotion for this stuff. What is she gonna get angry about? What? Dialogue's a little bit different, I think. But then again, I didn't really memorize the dialogue. This seems familiar though. It's like they skipped some dialogue in the direct. Are they gonna be talking about, uh. Turf War and Rank? Anarchy? Stages? Because I would like to know. Oh no, they're gonna skip over it here. I'm gonna have to wait until the retail release of the game to see what a regular newscast is like. Or Splatcast, in this case. Splatfest Teens. Alright, well, we're gonna save that for later. Seems like. We have a lot more animations with just wa walking around, like... I can walk here and I can be looking at something. I have my head tilted a little bit to look at something. What the heck is going on here? Wait, what? How? We're not even playing yet! Anyway, are we gonna get them? Oh no, it's just reloading everything. What are the maps? Hmm. So regular maps and ar anarchy maps are changing, even though we can't technically play them. Oh, Salmon Run's all a mystery. Wow. 
I heard some music over here. Is this coming from Hatlantis? Oh, it is. Oh, it's the music that plays inside the place. Oh. Nice. There's Kali Mari's signature. You have to be level 4 to shop here. I don't make the rules. Just go to the lobby and turn forward battles. Well, I could, I could come back here and listen to the music. Probably shouldn't do that while I'm recording. Oh, wait! Oh, so this is how we prepare for Splatfests in this game. Like... Like... Like the like the lobby progressively gets darker the closer we get to Splatfest. Oh that's an interesting idea. Oh and I, I assume these shops also appear. Yeah, we really need a Splatoon 4. The graphics could look a whole lot better. I mean not to saying that they look horrible, like this is probably better than what the Wii U could have done. But, you know, I, I want to see more detail besides just, oh, well, look, a clump of food and some pixelated food and trays. Got some food stalls. Here's where you can make posts. Surprise, you can actually make posts. You can't climb that. Can't climb that ourselves, but apparently jellyfish can climb this thing. I saw a clip. Small things are going to be patched. What's down there? It's like, um, it's like what we have in Chicago. Oh, it, it exactly is! Wow! Oh, and here's Big Man stage. So they just sit here before they start dancing on them? You can tell it's Big Man stage because this is the middle piece. There was a shop here, but it's all closed 